Good afternoon to the panel, to law enforcement officials that are present. First off, I want to give honor to God for allowing all these families to come here and express their feelings toward the law enforcement community. I will give God praise in everything that I do. So I want to thank the Legislative Black Caucus for holding this police conversation. It's really very important. I know I only have two minutes. I have two questions. Both of them are directed to Commissioner Bass. Commissioner Bass, I heard you say that you have officers that you relegate or delegate responsibilities to. That's the reason why you had Mr. Rodriguez come up here, Chief Hill come up here, and the Colonel here. But ultimately, the responsibility falls on you. You are held accountable for what your officers do. Now, of course you know that. So my question is, as family members of victims of homicide, we deserve to be treated with dignity and respect in the entire process of investigation. Thank you. you say you want to be transparent. How can you be transparent when the family is not involved in that investigation process? The process is supposed to be going all done. Give us a reason why the family is not included in that investigative process to keep us abreast as that investigation proceeds or go on. That's question one. If you would, write it down so that you can answer it. My second question. I heard Mr. Rodriguez state specifically about the officer's bill of rights. The family has rights. He also stated that the officers are investigated within the department. We haven't heard or seen of any disciplinary action that's been done to any officer after the state's attorney sends a declination letter out to the public and to the family. So we want to know what type of punishment can, will be instituted on officers when the state's attorney refuses to prosecute them. Do they just get by? Or do they do nothing? They get a free vacation and get paid. Community. So those are my two questions. But before I leave, I want to thank you all for holding this for holding this conversation with the police. Because my family, I'm the uncle of Tyrone West. And I've been there every step of the way in the back watching what has been happening. Commissioner Batts did not contact my family until he was on a radio program and received a call from my wife. He instructed Chief Hill, you better call that family. But the family deserves more respect than that. He's ultimately responsible for any officer under his command gun. Thank you again.